Thanks for messing around in Vampire Survivors 280. We've got Lama Ladonna leading a group into the whiteout. Let's see how well it goes. Uh, da, 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 da. Bolero is just having generic. All right, so we got Imelda Bell piece. I'll whip that out immediately. Gennaro Bell piece and Arca Ladonna. Now, what's the relation to Lama Ladonna and Porta Ladonna and Santa Ladonna? Who knows? I like this game really has lore behind last names, beyond last names. Also get that chest. Alright, I mucked with the collection a bit more so that way I only have eight passives that are helpful instead of five that are racingly meh. But here we go. And of course I get a random event into shooters. Why wouldn't there be? Why are they going so slow? Right, because everything here on this map is slow. And I have misspell flaming. Well, can't evolve that in the ashes because I'm not getting Torona's box. That is way too dangerous, especially for a llama. And that very dangerous. Yeah, I get more curse and higher stats when I level up. That's very dangerous. And we can't have that. Anyway. That's a maxed out empty tome. Ooh, why? Ironically, this will actually be Gennaro's fifth one, so... Hey! At the end of this video, we're gonna have two characters with five stages done in the fifth wave. Fifth wave, for those of you who didn't read or didn't watch the last one, go watch it. And if you didn't, the fifth wave will be I controlling one character. In this case, LaDonna, Lama, who hasn't beaten five stages. Well, having three co-ops in, who also haven't beaten the stages. But because I can't just do it in a big old group like I did with the fourth wave, it's just going to be filling in whoever the first ones are, first three are that haven't beaten the stage, or have had their five stages done on the fifth wave. Really, the only way I could do this, because it's not, no one has, you know, Five empty stages with the characters they're all next to anymore. No one has like more than one or two. Maybe three at most for someone down low. Otherwise, this is the best that's going to be done. And I have a whole list about who does what, which is why it's Llama's time. Llama time! All right, things are going fine now. Surprisingly light on the turkeys, but the Blairo is making up the power-ups. And I can't stop them from attacking, so... That's why they're attacking. Hey, there's some NFT action. Some big Aura Logans to beef it up. I only wanted the eight most helpful passives. So since I couldn't do that, because I'm on random. Hyper hurry random. Plus random events. Random level ups, random events. That's also part of the fifth wave. That's sort of incidental. Void out. That's just sort of the standard at this point. Make sure things could actually move in a pattern that doesn't result in these videos ballooning out to three hours. And it's going to get bad. And it's going to get a bit bad. On the flip hand, at 20 character stage combinations done a video, it would take barely over 50 more days in order to finish this. Though certainly I will run out of characters before then. Now, oh, double or Logan. Man, Bolero would be so good on Whiteout. All those evolution chests, all those extra chests, the stage is so starved for chests. And I keep getting weapon pickups, which is Rives. Yay, revives. The black chest, for those of you who don't know, for the Moonlight Bolero. Oh, hey. Early Arcana. How about some Sonal Sanctuary? Get that cooldown maximized. Black chests will give you only passives, and they can give you passives that you haven't picked up. And ones... But not ones you have sealed. That only comes from random events and map pickups. Yeah, and I guess Armadillo. Huh. 
knowledge. Yeesh. Anyway, I'm only controlling the one character who hasn't beaten the five stages, the earliest one along. The other three are here just so I could get this done sometime this century, because there's no way I could just, if I'm just sticking it like even if just one character with five per video, I would still be looking at like 200 videos and Ponkle adding another stage and another character, which would result in almost 200 each time. Well, each new character is only like 20, but a new stage is at this point over 80. Which results in over a hundred. And I can't keep that up, even at five. But at twenty, I'll win this eventually. And then once it comes back, once new stages and characters comes back, I'll be back on doing that. So well there's not much I can kind of do about some things. Yeah. Well, any new character will just run through the waves as they are. First wave, which is just paper. No gimmicks, no nothing. Just run it through. And then wave two, which is two stages. In order. And those two stages, they will only have one weapon on inverse as well. So all the enemies will be even beefier. Then we'll head on over to the third wave. They beat three stages with only three weapons, three passives, and three arcanas. But without inverse. So it's actually feasible. Good grief. And then the fourth wave. It's me controlling four characters. Except if there's only one character at least, how am I supposed to do that? Now clearly I'll just grab the one character and then or three others. I won't just cheese it with the invincible characters or Queen Sigma or Sammy. I will do it right away. The right way. I have Labrador. Jeez, have I just really not beginning any luck with the pickups? Or with the random level ups getting me my axes? Oh, this should be Death Spiral, finally. I could banish the Tronus box, it'd be here, but I don't have control over that. Man, that's what... Eight revives. If I get awake, then... It'll be up to eleven, and there's nothing that can stop me. Man, I've forgotten how good it was to have Empty Tome, constantly. It's such... a relief to have the best passive. Well, now that I think about it, ground only really affects the holder, so I could probably trade that off for, well, nothing. I mean, the most useful one is, like, Amrola. Or sometimes Bracer if I need an evolution. But, Candle Labrador is for a llama. Gotta refine the rules as they go. And hopefully sometime it'll work out. Hopefully it will. But I doubt it. Because nothing ever works out. I could get away, but I don't need that. Instead I will get Fire Mist for double attacks. Also I have Flames of Misspell, so it actually kind of works in with it. It's basically constant fire now at this point, so that's funny. Only 20 minutes on whiteout. Only 20 minutes. And this is being recorded less than three hours before it's supposed to go up. I am good at time management. The whole point of me switching the time was that so I didn't keep running into this thing where I'm recording it in single digit hours before the video has to go up. But that would be smart to not do that. Also, so it would stop interfering with being at the same time as my streaming. So, if it's 12 hours from when this video goes up, that means I'm streaming. In fact, if it's 12 hours after this video goes up, that means I'm streaming Super Holo Wars. A Holo Life fan game based on Super Robot Wars. A RPG that is about giant robots from various series, or sometimes original series. Well, not original series, but original creations. 
fighting alien invaders and demon invaders and magical invaders and enemy nations and genetically modified Superman and regular Superman and regular dudes and spaceman. Like basically every threat that exists has shown up in a Super Robot Wars game at some point or a Super Robot genre at this point. Now in this case, it's more of a normal thing. Hey, that's a rosary. Hey, that stalker. That's what you get for following me on like a puppy. I grief, I got so many. I don't know why the other two aren't getting any. I don't know why Arca is still getting so many. How is he getting so many? Hey, a candy box. I know what I should get. Another weapon pickup with Armadillo. I mean, it doesn't matter at this point. At all. What's the worst weapon I could get? Da da da. I got a bone to pick with you, says Llama. Well, Corella would have been worse, but at least someone sees bone and says, Okay, that's not the worst weapon in the game. Why are you still here, Stalker? Did I say you could move? No. You can die, though. And that's another weapon pickup, which is another level. Which means Bone just got three more levels. Hehe. <laughs> Bone. Why are you still here? I got your chest. And you can still do damage. You cheaty cheater. Cheat, cheat, cheater. I know it's because he was frozen during it, but he dropped the chest, so that should count, right? Well, not that it matters with as many weapon pickups. Rhymony. So many weapon pickups, so many Orologians. All that luck coming into play. Hey, Reaper. You're not getting llama today. Point one on the death spiral. 463 on Holy One. And Lightning Ring did a lot. In fact, it did the most. Weird. Price of Hours Beswick, 280. Llama Ladonna's going fast on Carlo Kart. He's got a Melda Bell piece again. Porto Ladonna, because Arca's taking a break. And Christine Devano, I think her last name is. Devane? Devane. I can just have llama stick on the bottom to get it. Ooh, I got garlic. Too bad I can't evolve it. Random. Yeah, that figures I miss. There's only one... Boy, Christine. Boy, Christine. Oh, well. I can just go right. I'll end the glory. Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's the boss. Bolero, bu 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 bolero. It's gonna be slightly less helpful here. I probably should have grabbed. Yeah, this feels really weird. It's like when the thing is on, it actually allows me to move to the right, but when it's not, it doesn't allow me to do it correctly. It feels like I'm still moving, but when it wears off. I'll jink out and slow down and stop. Now maybe just the speed lines is doing that. Where did you get, how did you get science rocks? Well, through random events, obviously. Random level ups. Oh, garlic, my garlic. Well, at least if I get a candy box or some rolla, random event can take care of it. I mean, that would still be better pick up than crown. But anything think crown cancels out. The pentagram at one point, maybe. Or it won't. What was that? Uh, oh, man, there's so many science rocks. It's like these are rocks of science. And they can't be stopped. They're just stick in the middle-ish. 
Oh, it's so nice in co-op. You don't ever have to lose a single one here. And yet I still did. Who needs to be good at video games when you got the ability to be bad at video games a lot? Eventually I'll pull off enough good plays that you'll want to watch me. Enough that you'll want to watch me. Woohoo. And there goes yet another chest. Sure can't have too many of those. That's probably the Arcana Bat floating up there. Carlo Card is thankfully a merciful 15 minutes long, which ends up being like 7 minutes after it gets hurried down. I really just wanted to beat every stage with every character. I could just have Melomania carry everyone to the end. But I don't want to do that. Boring. There's nothing to do. Nothing to talk about. Why I did the Ghost Lino... Wait, that was on top of the... Huh. Whatever. Did you destroy the Arcana chest at some point, Christine? I wouldn't be surprised if she did, somehow. Yay. And there's Stalker and a Mario Kart. Mario Kart. Yeah, that's clearly what I meant, not Mario Kart. Totally separate things. Yay, Llama got some chicken. And Imelda got really lucky there and still hasn't been hit. Oh, Christine went down. That's what you get. That's what you get for pentagramming everything. Oh, she got full health somehow. Good. Why did you go after Porta of all targets, Stalker? Man, I actually have to do some tricky maneuvering around here of how weird things got set up. I mean, I do need to make sure that Llama gets him, because, well, they're the one collecting everything. I don't know where the other Arcana have shown up. I guess they all just coincidentally got vaporized by Pentagram. No involvement to stuff here. Yep. Second run over the science rocks. In fact, they're very helpful. Weird. Should I be using these considering I don't want to control the other characters? No. No, I shouldn't. Well, if you want to chew me out, the comments are down below. Please chew me out. I desire it. I need it. Give me everything you've got. I can take all of it and more. I like comments. Who doesn't like a comment on their video? I need to comment on more videos. I have been slipping after that whole impending threat of homelessness because I don't have a job thing. I should not be chipper at all. But here I am with two puncture wounds in my body. Money going down the drain. And nothing to look forward to. This Holo Cure got pushed back to probably November. My most successful series yet. Forever, really. For a definition of success. In a very small, pond sort of way. But I will swim that pond, and I will swim it good. I haven't given up hope no matter what my life is like right now. Clearly I'll never give up hope. 400,000. Oh, because you kept wiping out the Reapers. Otherwise, Lightning Ring did the most. Okay, it's time for the Laboratory in Vampire Service Beswick 280. We got Lama Ladana again, Melda Bell Peace again, Porto Ladani, and the ever-famous Poe Racho, who will actually be able to evolve his weapon. As he has inbuilt Max Out Perona because he's retired from the adventures. I never mentioned this at all, did I? Huh. 
Well, that's why Amalda has the maxed out empty tome. And starting with a maxed out empty tome is very helpful at any point. Because when do you not want max empty tome? Like with Onibaba. And probably only Onibaba. But here we are on the laboratory. Fifth wave of rules. And I realize I'm probably going to have a lot of difficulty getting five characters after a while. Or someone who doesn't actually have a stage done under the rule set. That is for me in 20-ish days to deal with. Well, no, it's... Wow, that was really early. And you're picking it up on the character I wanted on. Nice. Uh, once more, the Arcana is somewhat limited. Valero is just super helpful as well. I want chess. I want power. I want loot. Hey, I also want to catch the train. Zap. Speaking of trains, I got stuck behind a train the day I recorded this. It was awful. That was 10 minutes added to my trip. I had no idea if the train was actually going to stay on the tracks, because I saw those wheels. They are rusted to all hell. I was seriously thinking if this train tripped and I somehow survived, I was going to be in a world of rage. Instead, I'm nice and chipper because I didn't die to a train. I suppose we should all be nice and chipper because we didn't die to trains, right? Oh wow, I can go really high up. Da, 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 da. Wow, I have nothing. That means no one else probably has anything either, and also I should have been grabbing one of these chests anyway, because... Even if the other one is nothing. It could still be nothing. And also, because I keep moving, I am going to keep Vento saccharine to the max. Hey, another train to catch. Ooh, we got some tonguing from Porta. I didn't notice. I was too busy concentrating on Llama's mighty thews. Let's go, Llama. Got some Ladonna to do. I need to get rid of these shooters. They're annoying. Hey, you gave me a chest. Thank you. Why is Porta getting it? All right, I uh, don't want any of these. The controller is cold. I just did Sapphire. That's actually got some energy with some of the stuff I have, kind of, maybe. Or I could just get Slash since I have Axes and Death Spirals kind of come up. Or Gemini for literally no benefit whatsoever. Uh... Well, blood astronomy for Poe. Now there's something else. Oh, that doesn't. Prime Lola does it to wax power. Huh. There we go. How about some nice beginning action? I want more axes. I want more axes. Don't you want more axes? We all want more axes. Let's go not break into the fire department. Because we don't want to steal firefighter axes. That will end up poorly for all of us. They know how to use them. Most people don't. The trick is to get the choppy end in where you want to chop it. Hey, a vacuum. That looks like Poe maxed out his garlic. That means next chest should get Soul Eater. Or I could just, you know, get more axe. Lightning Ring is still going to be a Lightning Ring no matter where you go. Alright, haven't had a loss yet. There's been something of a close call, but... Altogether, this is going so simple, it's almost disgusting comparison. 
suppose that's what I get when I actually, you know, make sure I get the passives I want. Take out some of the weapons that aren't going to be doing much. Like, birds and guns. Not evolving those outside of the characters they're with. Heck, I'm not going to evolve them with random events, period. I mean, in theory, they could evolve. It's not going to happen in practice. You see what my luck is like. Awful. Horrendous. T -t 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 Terrible. Beyond comprehension. Here we go. Also, I should, in theory, be three videos still more up. That bloody power outage. That would require foresight and intelligence. Things I am famously lacking. Oh, I have a mini imposter here. How did that happen? Still not have Soul Eater. I swear I saw a garlic pop up with a, maybe it was a six or a five. Numbers famously infused with eight in certain formats. I want to talk, but all I can think about is a clip about Craig Ali and Pavolo Rain drawing Mori Calliope during a drawing session because that just crossed my algorithm again. Right now, Polo Live Advent Gen 3 English is playing Earth Defense Force 6. The new true ultimate super duper despair. And I want to watch it. But instead, I have to record Vampire Survivors because even if this gets all of one or two views, I will still say that I did it. I did the Beswick. The best of my capabilities, even though I should be recording all the messed up footage I got. I, mean, I don't even have an excuse. It's not like it was something live I did with people. But I didn't. Because I'm an incompetent ronk. Yeah, that's a right, a ronk. I'm a whole new level of gunk. Good grief, is it really only 12 minutes? Why are you getting thundering? Do I not? I have candle to wear. Actually, somehow it has three up there. The train is not returned. It's no longer docking. I guess Saban has suplexed it away. Really the mightiest character of all time. How many others do you know has suplexed a train? No one, because it's suplex. Good on you for noticing that. Hey, I finally got my bloody death spiral. Now time to make the enemy bloody with it. Except you're not competing with Th Lightning Ring and Thunderloop. From a... Wait. Minus 77. Okay, that makes... Hmm. That feels a bit lower than it should be. I feel like there's a, something I'm missing here. Oh well, I'll just instead destroy robots. Yay, robot destruction. Who could be sad about robot destruction? Not I. Well, the robot destruct them all. They will not know what hit them. It will be lightning that hit them. Llama is really not doing much, comparatively, other than ex getting a bunch of experience. I can really go so far away from the starting positions of two, three, and four. Now, Gennaro didn't have laboratory done, but Gennaro has had five stages done. Gennaro is now retired along with Antonio, and Llama will be after this, and possibly... Heck, 
Imelda Belvis herself. We got the laboratory here. Update. It'd still be a good month or there might be something in spoopy month. For vampire survivors. Am I missing passive? Eh, I don't care to look for it. Got a bone to pick with you. Llama loves his bones. That's like Death Spiral if it was worse in every way. There's a lot of weapons if you think about it. Everything is just worse than something else. Like, why have any weapon at all when you can have Paranormal Scanner and Affinion? What's getting through that? Nothing. Hey, it's a train! Woo! No, I guess I could have gotten whip. But I don't think Fuwala Fuwala was happening. Heck, I'm not even sure if Max now bone is happening. The llama is certainly gonna try. More chest action. More. Right back to you, huh? Is it whoever's getting the XP gets the chest? That would explain quite a bit, actually. Uh, huh. Hey there, enemy dudes. You're actually not getting in, because without inverse or curse, you are much weaker than normal. Well, I suppose there are... Normal is this. I'm just the one who's boosting them up to absurdities. Hey, and I'm out one. Wow, you took down Poe. Yeah, he got Soul Eater. Bye-bye, Death. I'm not dealing with you any longer than I have to. 0 0.4 on the Death Spiral, 8.3 on Echo Knight, 3.3 on Thunder Loop and Soul Eater. Well, Poe is retired after all. Woohoo, Vampire Survivors Bez with 280. We got some backcountry action with Lama Ladonna, Melda Bell Peace, Porta Ladonna, and Arca Ladonna. I don't know why I did it in that order. Anyway... By the end of this, I should actually have three characters, four, five, four, four characters done with their fifth wave stuff. Whoever could have guessed that getting 20 bit character stage character combinations done a video would be very fast getting this done. In fact, it would take less than, f just take, at the current rate, it would take nearly over 50 videos to be finished with the Beswick. Ooh, yay. Yeah, yeah. Now I can get a sweet, sweet Boogaloo of Illusion. Okay, the gems were going to Arca, so I guess, yeah, whoever's getting the gems for the level up is the one who also gets the chests for stuff. That, I don't know why it does it like that, but hey. Does it, and I've undercovered a mystery. So oh, I wonder if you knew that's how it worked. It really took me a while to figure it out. Yet it could take so much longer. Also, all the controllers got messed up except the first player one. Because they were not touched during any of that. Well, the one Amelda's. No, not Amelda's. Well, the one that's currently Arca's. No, the one that currently is Amelda's. Was fine. Oh no, bats. I'm scared of the bats. Oh. Oh, hey, another Arcana chest. That's super good. Okay. Flash affects claw, doesn't it? No, why doesn't it affect the claw? Well, whatever. Get Sapphire missed. Okay, Melda's getting the gem, so yes, I suppose that's the second confirmation that it goes to whoever's acting as the level eater. 
That sounds so weird, but kind of the correct thing to say. Wait, I can afford to not get Silent Sanctuary right now. Because, well... No, get away from her. Neo. Oh, weapon pickup. That's helpful. Endlessly helpful. In fact, that means I basically can't lose. <laughs> with how it works with Moonlight Bolero. I probably knew that beforehand, didn't I? If I had just select that during the Operation Guns characters in their fourth wave stuff, it'd be no trouble. But instead, I'm here. Troubled. That country is four. Yes. Oratory, Carlo Kart, wait out, back country, and then it'll be Astral Stare. Yeah, more, more Arcana. I want all the Arcana. Never stop arcana -ing. Heck, maybe I should have gone Wicked Season. Pretty sure with enough luck, it'll be nothing but Arcana Chess. And you can't beat 50, all the Arcana in the game. Too bad I can't get over to them Golden Rings outside Mad Groovin. Fight with some Atlanteans? That sounds like a brawl I'd be more than willing to take at the moment. Oh, I probably should have indicated that curse is turned off in this shop, because otherwise the numbers get too dopey. 200% curse off the start? That's not great. It's quite terrible, in fact. Now, 200% luck? Now, that's some um, maps you want. Maps. 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 And right into the bonus wall. Go figure. And the imposter again. I got more. And Porta has the tongue in two. Again. Weird. Ooh. Some good tongue in there, Porta. I bet you do whatever Santa is related to you proud. Familiar connection Santa is to you proud. You should learn some stuff from her, Arca. You should learn some stuff from her. Anything here even benefit from Spellbinder? No. No. It's not like I really had anything better. So like, like my best option other than that is Pomerola. Because a tract orb, if it doesn't land on the main character, isn't that helpful. I'm not selecting anything. And the same thing, well, I mean, I guess a generic 50% luck boost is fine. But, I mean, it's not the greatest. But anything that gets spellbindered correctly is a big boon. Well, not like it really matters when I'm going to backcountry. I can't stop here. I can't stop here. This is bat country. I don't even know where that's from. More tonguing. Or at least the meme template it became. I mean, the first thing I think I heard of it was this can't stop here. This is Bahamut country from the Dark IDs Dirge of Cerberus Let's Play. Dirge of Kerberus Let's Play. Neither ripped to a real one or sawed off. Boy, was that a mess. And I will not talk about it. You want to know? Well, TV Tropes is right over there. Well, some funny stuff, though. Still some funny stuff. Probably one... Th well, I am finished with all Guardsmen Party, and I'm going to be finished with... Polo stuff. Polo pages, eventually. 
Well, I'll need something to read while I'm donating. Maybe I'll just head back. For no, no, not with the images and the text and nightmare. Nope. Oh, well, I mean, what else do I have? Can't play video. Can't play video. I do not have any sort of AirPod. Uh, you know, if it wasn't for some wretched luck, I could have actually gotten the donation done in two hours, less than two hours. It would have been the fastest time I ever got in and out, period. If it wasn't just for some nonsense like the train. And you know, every intersection I was trying to cost being a nightmare. Like it was, I am so perfectly that train thing was coming down right as I was stepping on the sidewalk next to it. I was so tempted to just run through it. And nope, 10 minutes stuck behind a train with wheels so rusty I could see flakes flying off. Wondering in terror where I would go if it flipped off the tracks. Woohoo! A fifth arcana. Now we're stronger than ever before. Do we want more axes? Why do I not have... I don't... Do we want things to explode? I mean, more axes. Because for some inexplicable reason, I still don't have death spiral. Getting limit breaks here, game. Where's my chest at? I have Bolero, I can't be running out of chests. Right here's the 16 minute chest. All the way up here. Come on, come on, give me Death Spiral. There we go. Oh, right. One of the Arcana bounces axes. I should have grabbed that one. That would have been funnier. And well, slash affects it too, but I don't want to do slash. Man. I expected the other three to be dead weight since they know can't move, but apparently not moving is the easiest thing in the world. Alright, I need to hit A on them so they don't disconnect. I'm still on the original battery they came with too, so that's neat. Maybe I didn't need those charger packs. That was money I could not have, you know, I could have, you know, used. We've got some more Got some big fuzzy fists from Llama here. Whoa. Double evolution. Triple evolution. Melda is once more slipped down lower. I don't know. I just randomly switches who everyone but player one is. Weird. Well, backcountry was no trouble. I don't know what that warning was. Stopping here was not particularly a problem. I mean that for people that weren't fine preferers of bat destruction. Still. Oh, thunder loop. The last second. Thunder loop. We watch everything go up high. I'm not letting you cheat us, Death. I got five Arcana. 
800k, 1.9, 6.5. Wow. Llama's leading more vampire survivors. Beswick, 280. Out of bounds. Melda Balpice has completed her five, so Pascaline Balpice is put in. Porta Ladana is not coming since so she's already completed Astral Stare. We got Poe Racho instead, and Arca Ladana is here to get his five as well. So out of this video, we will have four more characters completing their five on the fifth wave. Also, I really need to go hit that on the right there before things get out of hand. Are they getting bigger? They killed Poe already. And I just gotta sort of hope I can get rid of them. Of course there's cats. Why wouldn't there be cats? Wait, does the Pomerol only affect the controller? Yes, it only affects the character it has. Also, Poe has so much more health regeneration when he's retired. Right. Yeah, you never pay attention to how much Pomerol actually heals. Well, this isn't off to a good start. But more axes always is a good thing to have. You know, thankfully Poe is somehow durable enough that this is fine for now. Also, he picked up Baco Batlier, which is kind of very helpful for it. So, hey, neat. And Arca has taken after Sister to get some tongue in action going. I uh, can't get those golden fingers without a mad grooving. Time for just a weapon pickup. Well, those it could be worse. I don't really know offhand how it could be worse, but I suppose it could be. I just have to think really hard about it. I ran into the eyeball, didn't I? I need to or Logan you. Oh, and you go down. You're a sad man. Why are you dead? Oh, right. The starburst. Why are you dead? That didn't... I was at a menu. Why did you get hit by it? Well, yeah, I was in a menu. Weirdo. Oh, right. Cats hurt. Boy. The worst, huh? Well, there's another goblin. Your amount of stuff coming in is kind of hard for Poe to deal with. Oh, thank you, sweet, sweet Arcana chest. What would be most helpful? I know, Silent Old Sanctuary, the most helpful Arcana there is. That will solve so many of my issues. Wait, is that the map one, or was that Moonlight Bolero beefing? At least I don't have to worry about Poe. He's earned that rocking chair. He's earned it. Now, of course, Selena and Arca have nothing to contribute to this. Well, at least I have all those. Well, I suppose uh, Arca is hoarding all these weapon pickups. That's nice. And it's Pascalina who has the diver mines, so diver mines really. Couldn't you have gotten something helpful? Like anything but diver mines? I would take the no weapons from Simundo over that. Ow, that hurt. That pain is really much. I should put something on my neck. Like I should put something on my arm so they don't bruise. I can donate and I can ward off homelessness a bit further. 
I know I'm whining about this, but I need to vent at points so I don't ball it all up and then explode at people who don't deserve it. Like a healthy adult male, as I clearly am, and not some sort of weird talking robot man. Robot man, robot man, where have you ever been, my life, robot man? The true secret seventh robot master. And not that jerk. Bubble man. One is ro zero is Roto man. One is rock. Mega man. Two is roll. Then th three, four, five, six, seven, eight are the rest of them. Then Wiley just switches all their numbers around because he's a jerk like that. And sort of start stealing numbers for robots he didn't make. Because he's a jerk like that. And when he just copies them, he just copies them. Oh wow, Soul Eater. All I'm saying is Mega Man collab with Empire's Fire is very easy. You have so much material to work with. But get Sukaden first. Get more people interested in Sukaden. Sukaden, Sukaden, Sukaden. Wait, what? Oh, ran into a starburst, really? Sweet, sweet arcana chest. Sweet, sweet triple arcana chest. And this is a character that is being controlled by another controller. Uh, what's... No, that's not the one that bounces. It's Iron Blue Will. Yeah, there we go. I want my axes to bounce. Oh, wait, it's Llama who has the cats. I didn't notice that at all. Alright, Death Spiral, let's bounce this popsicle stand. Really? Popsicle stand? I mean, I wish I had a popsicle stand. I haven't had a popsicle in years. Ice cream, sure. Popsicle, no. But there's so many calories. Well, I mean, you just gotta adjust for it. That's all you gotta do for your diet. Sure, this cake may be an atrocious amount of calories, but just eat light somewhere else. Or heck, do it light the other day. Zigzag that diet. Really, again, you... Okay, well... What was the intelligent one? None of these were intelligent. This isn't intelligent either, but I wanna do it. There's got to be a golden finger somewhere around here. I just have to find it. Why did the golden finger is going to not, not get drawn in? What? They don't get picked up by Mad Groove? That doesn't make sense. Why wouldn't they? Oh, these stupid cats. Not like all the cats in my life. They're all great kitties, even when they bite me. And they're feral. Well, there's nothing bruising, so it should be fine, right? Right? <laughs> Rabies shots are overrated. No, I didn't get Hollow Heart because of Pomerola. Go figure. Oh, hey, the bullets are bouncy too because of Iron Blue Will. I mean, they're weak as all get out. They're bouncy. Yay, bouncy bullets. Bouncy, bouncy bullets. Oh, hey, some wings. Zoom, now Llama cannot be stopped. Uh, and there's a celestial egg, and once more the mini imposter. I'm at four arcana, right?
All right, stay in the farthest corner I can from that celestial egg, so the one character I need to survive survives. Also, Poe will mostly heal up any. What? Why is it dead? How is it dead? How are you dead? Stop being dead. My damage shouldn't be high enough to destroy this cosmic egg like that. 79 for Belair's sake. I can barely tell where Llama is half the time anymore. Vampire survivor's problem. Oh wait, does the Hellkite count, Heldrake count as Terminus? That would make sense. No wait, it's not Terminus, it's... Extremus? Minoris Majorus Terminus Extremus, yes. Just those two, Life Tyrant and the Heldrake that are Extremus. Once more, with feeling. Five Arcana rush down. This is worthless for everyone, but I will grab it anyway. I mean, I could have grabbed something helpful like er, Slash, I guess. But who wants that? Well, beginning. Beginning would have been better. I should have grabbed beginning. That would have resulted in more axes. Well, on the other hand, Poe is out here doing that, so... What the heck is going on? Cosmic eggs are not fragile. Why are they going down so easy? I know it doesn't have Curse backing it up, but still. Uh, is my level really just that low? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. This is where no cats are. Oh, I can break out of this system. Break out. We got everything. This is our time. We're yours to discover. How am I have health left? Well, Poe went down. It kind of doesn't matter. Especially when the Reaper comes. The Reaper comes. We got 10.2 million on the cats. How? Why? Oops. Oh well, that's the end of this video. And with another 20 stages down, we are at 929 character combination stuns on the Vampire Survivor Beswick. 280. That leaves us with 1,026 more to go. And then tomorrow, it's all the way over to Giovanna as she drags up some top feeders down below. Going around. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Please, anyone who hasn't, like, dislike, comment, or subscribe. Did you know that the chests go to whoever has the experience vacuum at the moment in multiplayer? I didn't till now. And thank you, anyone who already has, like, dislike, comment, or subscribe. The support keeps me going. I hope everyone has a good day and you keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.